What's going on everybody? Welcome back to another video. Johnny coming at you with some TTM reveals. Uh, we got three TTMs in the box. For those of you that don't know what TTMs are, they're through the mail autographs. We, uh, I send players um, requests for their autographs with a fee, sometimes with not a fee. Uh, we wait on the returns and I report back to you guys and document it on my channel to see the good, the bad, the ugly, and the stupid. We also have a blind trade from our friend Tony in Canada. Nice. We'll see what that's about here. Let's start with the TTMs here first, guys. Hope everyone's having a great day. Um, we're going to start, uh, let's start with this one here. We're going to start with North Texas, Dallas, Texas. Uh, three of three success, zero fee in 14 days. And that is cool. Mr. Jose Guzman. Got him on my 1988 Donruss orange background. You guys know I love that set. Um, sweet. For the do, uh, for the Texas here pitcher, I believe he's working in broadcasting um, now. So I think you do send that to the broadcasting teams of whatever team he's working. Here he is when he was playing for the Cubs um, on a, what is it, a pinnacle, what, 93 maybe? Looks like, yep, 93 Pinnacle, and then a 1989 Tops. So nice blue ink by Jose Guzman. Thank you, sir, for your autograph. I love that I'm still getting these orange backgrounds in. All right, so first one down. Next one looks like it's coming out of North Texas as well. Dallas, Texas, 202, zero fee, 19 days to get. Oh, nice, Mr. Bobby Witt. Um, guys, here you go. This is his 1986 Fleer rookie card. Shout out to Patrick. Patrick, I think you were the one who sent me this one. Um, I sent his 86 Donruss rookie out, and uh, you gave me this one, so I had to send this out. And then I got a whole bunch, a set of these, and I'm um, starting to send out. Thought it would be really good, this uh, light yellow background. So inks uh autographs really pop off so thank you mr bobby witt guys i think bobby witt Ju uh bobby witt jr that's his son i believe bobby witt is a two now uh two per i believe last time i sent him um i sent him maybe five and he signed two he's been a great signer for us so let's not rock the boat and just send two of them guys he's been a great signer so those are the two that i sent and i'm happy with those returns let's get to this last one this is a cool one this is something different uh, I don't know where it's coming out of now, um, but this is how this worked. This is a baseball player. I don't know. He's not playing this year. He's a free agent pitcher. He is a huge TTMer. He also is a collector himself. Um, he might be a fee now, a very small fee. If he is, I'm sure I I've sent him before without, um, but this time I read an article in a Beckett that if you sent this player some cards, he'll trade back with you. So I actually sent him three blank cards of himself and then two pitcher old school pitchers that had their autographs on them that I got TTM and he sent me 19 days sent me five things back so Mr. Pat Neshack I don't know if you guys have seen him this is the first card that I sent to him found this um, older card looks like a 2009 tops found that for five cents I picked that up at a card show and I kind of slack, guys. I didn't, I didn't prep these cards. And the cards he sent me, he didn't prep them either. <laughs> anyway, that looks like some cool blue ink here. I thought that was a cool card. What else we get here? We got the um, Alan Ginter 2018. It started to fade a little bit. thought that was a really cool card there. Then I also sent this upper deck I found. When he played for the Twins, second year card, looks like it's a 2007 upper deck. Ink's kind of bubbly on it, but still a cool autograph. Then he sent me these two cards, which was a Bowman Chrome, which is a nice card, but man, he did not prep that at all. And then I believe I have this one already, and he sent me this. So this is nice. So Pat Nishak. I thought it would be something different to send multiple cards and uh, see what happens. All right, let's get to this blind trade, guys. I do a lot of trading, a lot of blind trades. Um, sometimes I can match what I 
what I can, and sometimes I just try to get some cards back, but it uh, looks like it's blind trade time. Coming all the way from our brothers in Canada. It looks like we got a note. Oh, wow, a whole bunch of stuff in here. Let's see what we got. June 2021. Dear Johnny, just a quick note from a fellow TTMer. I really enjoy your posts. Keep up the good work. Thanks, man. I appreciate that. Uh, I've included cards for a blind trade. Big fan of the Tigers, the Expos, and the Mets. I hope you like what I sent you. All the best from the Great White North, Tony. Tony, thanks, man. I appreciate your support on the channel. Um, thanks for um, sending me a blind trade. I'll see what I got, and let's see what you got here. Looks like a Chris Hollies on a 90 Fleer. I do not have that one. That's pretty cool. Oh, Doug Sisk. I have Doug Sisk, but not on an 84 Donners. I love these. I don't have a lot of 84 Donners. I like that, Tony. I appreciate that, man. Give me a New York guy there. Ka uh, Jeff Kaiser for the Cleveland Indians. Some blue ink on a 90. Looks like a 90 uh, tops traded. I love this set, too. Looks good with ink. I did not have that one. And then uh, Bobby Witt. I might have this Bobby Witt Fleer, but never a bad thing to get a Bobby Witt. I mean, look at that. I got Bobby Witt today. Bobby Witt day. And then the last one is a Matt Young, 1984 tops. Oh, OPG. Sorry, my Canadian buddy. That's even cooler, actually. Very cool. I'll see what I got. Hopefully, I'll, I'll be able to send you some cards here in the next day or so that you need. Guys, I appreciate everyone tuning in. If you don't mind, hit that like button. Think about subscribing. That helps the videos out. Um, talk to you soon. Johnny out.